Eddie Gordo, a legendary capoeira prodigy. Eddie's master was set to be free after a long prison sentence. However, his master had become a frail old man. This was not the master he once knew. Eddie had his master hospitalized. He was told that his master was terminally ill. A cure might be possible with technology from the Mishima Zaibatsu. A week later, Eddie enters the King of Iron Fist Tournament 5 to find a cure for his master. Tosan, a master of Taekwondo. On his way home from training, Peck was attacked and knocked unconscious. He woke up in a military hospital. According to the defense minister, he had been in a coma for over a year. The minister asked Peck to help train soldiers, and he hesitantly accepted. A year later, Peck writes to Huaren, asking him to return to the military. Huaran goes with his mentor. Now, the two enter the King of Iron Fist Tournament 5 as master and pupil. Hey, you still? <laughs> Jin's mind, 
and a deadly force has awakened. member of an international spy agency. Little is known about him other than the X on his face. On a mission to look into the Mishima Zaibatsu and G Corporation, he witnessed Heihachi Mishima swarmed by jacks. Later, he hears that someone would hold the King of Iron Fist Tournament 5. Raven infiltrates the tournament to find out more. Kazama. She was taught Kazama-style martial arts by her father. She was known as a nosy kid who liked to fix other people's problems, usually by knockout. Asuka came home one day to find that an unknown man had destroyed the dojo and put her father in the hospital. A detective from Hong Kong tells her the man will be in the King of Iron Fist Tournament 5. This one's personal.
，这，这是。是生死之交吗？金人，金八旗，今一度，杀鸡を踏み交わしたかったが、残念ながら迎えが来たようだ。親友よ、さらばだ。嬉しかったぞ。金八，金八，你西马家果真是被诅咒的一族吗
军霸气，看来我好像还不能跟你一起走啊！誰も私を止めることはできなかったか。<音声>